Good morning, fish heads. Jen Cravasi, Jekyll Bates, and it is your weekly workshop update. Okay, real fast, because we got lots to do today. I was going to go fishing, but then I'm like, ah, I got too much to do today, and I got to cut the grass. It's a ball game tomorrow night. I really want to fish tomorrow because it's going to be nice. So here we go. Here's your breakdown. Um, mice, mice, baby. Fools the cat. These all have to be dressed and cleaned before they go out the door. Red eyes on the lab rat, if you want to call it a lab rat. Actually, um, it's loosely based on an opossum. It's got the pink in the face, red eyes, good stuff. Storm coming extremely popular. Thanks, y'all. Glad y'all like it. It's got that UV white underlay black this is a deep pumpkin seed these are all going out today you can see most of them are boxed up so we're going to fly through this a south gill i haven't done one of these in a while but i got a customer request for it so very effective just started this um this is the first attempt this is a darter not a lace darter cj as i had inappropriately and, and wrongly called it. This is a rainbow darter. No such thing as a lace darter. It was from my fictionary. Sorry, y'all. But uh, the lines need to be thinner. I like the texturing in it. I like how generally the bait has turned out. But uh, we're going to fine tune this. I'm going to take it out this week and test it and uh, see what these gin clear fish think about it. American bullfrog. Hey, look, I got paint on my hand. I know you guys are shocked. Lake Charles. No, Lake Martin. Sorry, it's a Lake Martin red, not a Lake Charles. That's white on the bottom. These guys, let me tell you what. I'm having a blast with these foiled baits. Let's see if you guys can see a little bit of the foiling on the bottom and that yellow. The underside. These are all going out today. All this stuff is going out today. Now this one, I ran out of my normal eyes, and uh, thanks to John over at Jettison, he, I mean, look at these eyes, you guys. Good Lord, if you guys want awesome, awesome eyes, it takes a little time to get them because he handcrafts them all one by one. Um, go, uh, I, I hope I'm not slaughtering your last name, John Kimenis, Kimenis, over at uh, Jettison Eye Lures, is uh, Lure Eyes coffee yes have some these eyes are just unbelievably realistic so super happy with John and his eyes on the American bullfrog now these are lizard reptile he just he does a lot of specialty stuff look him up on Facebook and uh, go get some really killer eyes if you guys are into that sort of thing this is the volcano followed closely by the molten lava. Molten lava has a lot more yellow on the backside and a lot more deep flush red on the face. Ugh, sad to see these things go. I'm going to make more though. I'm going to make one today. The little Johns. These are dingers. Da -da. There you go. There you are. These are the texture. The oops, which really aren't oops. I like texturing kind of makes it look more realistic. Both of these crawls are going out. Everybody asks me where I get these. I get these boxes from clearbags.com. Spells like it sounds. C-L-E-A-R-B-A-G-S.com. Go check them out. This is, um, this is the Wildfire Shad. Those eyes came from Shelts. Easton is awesome. He also has pretty cool guys. Everybody on the planet that sells blanks and baits and, and stuff like that, they've got their own unique selection of really good eyes. Um, so just mix and match. Develop your own style. It's another pumpkin seed. These are the wild pumpkin, the foiled. Ah, don't want that. There we go. Sorry. The foiled pumpkin seeds. And you guys have already seen this one, but it's going out the door. That wiggle wart. Gotta love the wiggle warts. 
And that is it. It is Monday. Oh, no. You guys already saw that. It's Monday. I've got a ton of stuff to do. All those are prepped. Got Whopper Ploppers. You guys have a great week. Happy casting, and we'll see you on the next one.